आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ हेलो एवरीवन लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन सेज दैट डिफाइन द मैग्नीफाइंग पावर ऑफ अ कंपाउंड माइक्रोस्कोप व्हेन द फाइनल इमेज इज फॉर्मड एट इंफिनिटी व्हाई मस्ट बोथ द ऑब्जेक्टिव एंड द आईपीस ऑफ अ कंपाउंड माइक्रोस्कोप हैव शॉर्ट फोकल लेंथ्स एक्सप्लेन सो द मैग्नीफाइंग पावर ऑफ अ कंपाउंड माइक्रोस्कोप इज डिफाइंड एज द रेशियो ऑफ द एंगल सबस्टेंडेड बाय द फाइनल इमेज at the eye to the angle subtended by the object when both are placed at least distance of distinct vision so the magnifying power of a compound microscope is defined as the ratio of the angle subtended by the final image to the angle subtended by the object now when both are placed at the distance of distinct vision so at the least distance of distinct vision mathematically this is given as m where m is our magnification by v not image distance by object distance u not times 1 plus d by f of e you know f of e is focal length of ips in case the image is formed at infinity so when image is at infinity we get m e is equal to d by f e which we can translate to m is equals to o into m of e o and e represent the object on the i piece is equal to v not by u not times d by f e so it is product of magnifying power of objective and ips to have a large magnifying power both f e and f o which is similar to u o should have a small value with this we can conclude our answer therefore to have large magnifying power magnifying power focal length of eyepiece and object so focal length of eyepiece and focal length of object which is similar to object distance because for small objects it's almost similar should have a small value should have a uh, small value thank you class 6 to 12 se leke neat iit je hi mains aur advanced ke level tak 10 million se zyada students ka bharosa aaj hi download kare doubtnet app ya whatsapp kijiye apne doubts 8400400400 400 400 par